okay welcome back to the board we are going to learn about the notes on the fret board that's the notes on either the acoustic guitar or the lead guitar okay so you have your e your a your d your j your b and your e okay so let's draw 12 lines let's divide these lines into 12 parts I'm dividing it, it into 12 parts. Okay, so 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. So we've been able to divide it into 12 parts. Okay, so we're starting with our E string. So we are starting with our E string. That is the thicker string on the guitar or uh, the, so we are starting with our thicker string that is our E the thicker string the E okay so you have your E from your E you go to your F so there's no space between your E and your F from your F, you go to your G, but there's one space between the F and the G. So we have the G here. From your G, you go to your A. Leave one space between the G and A. Indicate your A over here. A, we go to the B. There's also space. But from the B and the C, there is no space in between. So we indicate our C over here. There's no space. So from your C, you go to your D. There's a space between the C and the D. So we have the D over here. From your D, you go to your E. There's a space between the D and the E. So leave one space between the D and the E. Okay. Now we got it. Okay. So let's fill up the spaces in between the G and F, A and G, B and A, D and C, and E and D. We are going to fill up those spaces. Okay. So from your F to your J, you have what we term as your F sharp. F sharp. F sharp. F sharp. You can also call that your J flat, but it's popularly called F sharp. Okay, so from your G to your A, you have the A flat, A flat, A flat. From your A to your B, you have what is called your B flat. From your C to your D, that's the C over here to our D here, we have what is called our C sharp. C sharp from your D to your E we have the E flat okay so we have been able to fill up all those pieces and interestingly once you get the names over here we are going to use those same names on the other strings so from your A you know that from your A here, let's go to our second string, that's the A. And we know from here that from our A, we go to our B, what? Flat. So from your A, you come to your B, flat, over here. So from your B, flat, to your B. From your B to your C, C to C, sharp, to our D, E flat, our E. From our E, we come to our heart, F, F sharp. Then our G, from your G to your heart, A flat, then to your A. 
Okay. So we have the notes on the A string. So let's come to our D string. From your D, you come to your what? E flat. So we have your E flat over here. From E flat to your E. From E to what? F. F to F sharp. F sharp to J. J to A flat. A flat to A. A to B flat. B flat to B. From B to C. C to C sharp. C sharp to your D. Okay, so we have all the notes on the D string over here. Okay, so let's move on to our J string. That's the fourth counting from top. The thickest one, two, three, four is our J string. So on our J string, we have our A flat. Then we have your A, your B flat, your B, your C, C sharp, your D, D to E flat, E, F, F to F sharp, then to your J. So here are all the notes on the J string. So let's go to our B. From your B, you come to your C, C sharp, D, E flat, E, F, F sharp, J, A flat, A, from your A to your B flat, and to your B. Okay, so these are all the notes on the B string. And for the E, we have the E at the top here. See this E, the same as the E at your bottom here. So you're going to repeat every note over here at this place too. So we have your F, F sharp, J, A flat, A, B flat, B, C, C sharp, D, E flat, and your E. Okay. So you can just pause the video and copy everything to either a sheet of paper or inside a book. Okay. So let's get back to the lead guitar.